Hey everybody, today we're gonna take a look at some great effect that is called Lone Shadow. Let's start. Let's create new composition. Composition, new composition. Rename it Lone Shadow. Choose OK. Now we create a background. We choose layer, new, solid. OK. Rename it background. <clears throat> Let's create some text layer. OK. Reposition it. Scale it. OK. Something like this. Now we have to precompose this layer. We choose layer, precompose, rename it text, text, move all attributes into the new composition, choose OK. Now we're going to find some effects. We begin with CC radio blur. Drag it on our comp. Here we choose straight zoom, amount 55. We also change the center of radial blur and drag it right here. The next effect we're gonna use is fill. Drag it. Choose the color, as I guess, something about here. Okay, looks great. The next effect is levels. Drag it. In levels we choose the alpha channel and drag this slider right right here to to get flat shape okay the next effect we're gonna use is cc composite composite drag it and now we get it somewhere and if we want to feather our shadow we can use linear wipe transition Drag it, rotate it a little bit, and feather this out, maybe 250, okay. um, we can also change the color of shadow and some we choose something like this so it looks great okay the great thing about it that we can animate uh, the text for example we can animate opacity here now we have some simple animation so and it also works here And you also can choose all these effects and choose animation and save it save it as your own animation preset. Rename it Long Shadow. So that's it. Thanks for watching. Thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to my channel. I'll see you next time.